Good evening. Hello, hello. Let's get started right away. I actually found a way to ally with Swabia, which I will do right away. Last time we just became the Roman Empire. And now let's expand a little bit. For example, let's take the Emirate, the Emirate of Cairo. Since now we have the Casus Belli Restore Imperial Province, which will let us expand quite a bit before we have to find new Casus Belli uh, again. So let's go. Actually, let's start from the top so he can't flank us as well. And anything else? Not really armies and unpause And the Emperor expands, most of all. Hey Johnny, how are you? Alright. That doesn't sound too... Uh, ...convinced. Something the matter? Oh, we got a new perk. <laughs> we can declare war for half a cost, but my current wars are for free as a Roman Empire, so I wouldn't even need that. to murder him again for now. Instead, let's try to murder you. Hey, Alec. Ah, okay, no problem. Thanks for telling me. Okay, now let's see if we find some Accomplices. Oh, right. Can't find accomplices since I'm paranoid. Completely forgot about that. Ah, okay, no problem. Um... Oof. <laughs> Hope you get better soon. Ah, oh, thank you so much, Alec. Okay, I had to give in to the demands of the Liberty Faction for now. But I can just change back in 20 years. So, doesn't matter what they are trying to do against me. He's trying to gather his armies there. 
No, that's the emirate. Random dude made an independence faction. Huh. Oops. My steward died. What's your specialty? Philosopher. Hmm. Uh, let's give it to this guy. Hey, Walter. What's up? How was the rest of your stream? Uh, am I already swaying him? No. Okay. Ah, okay. Yeah, I'm not much of an Instagram watcher, to be honest. Let's see if we can't increase our opinion. Since a very unhappy... Hey, thanks for follow, Phoenix. How are you? Last time we became the Roman Empire, we declared ourselves. And now we have the new Casus Belli, which is the Imperial Reconquest, which means we can declare a lot of wars for no costs. We can just march into one duchy after the other with little to no repercussions. Ah, banana economy. Hey. So it was worth, already worth advertising on a Discord server. Do you know this game or? Nah, scheme discovered. Okay. Then let's not keep doing this. Um, let's try to murder. Hmm. Who could we try to murder? Not really anyone, to be honest. Let's abandon the scheme. Because of Helm's Deep? You have to explain that one to me. Also economy. Um, do you know about Crusader Kings 3 or should I explain things or should I explain things about the game? Um, the session I'm having right now. Well, that whole thing uh, was a bit... I talked with um, Banana Man about that. Let's just drop it and forget about it since it was not good from any side. Good spy master. So let's hire you. Okay, I can imprison this Comtissa, so let's do that. Yeah, um, I kinda lost interest in. Minecraft for a while after that whole thing. So, I'll have to see if and when I rejoin the server. Because that was a little bit too much of a mess. Oh, 
that's a lot of captures. Let's put them all under house arrest. So I don't get a disease outbreak. my dungeons. Um. Nice, never right gear for four people. Wow, that's a lot. Well, that's really a dick move, Johnny. You can understand that. Oh, we built stuff. Uh, let's go into this view since it's faster. Okay, Alexandria, trade port, Antiochia, watchtowers, done. comes the counter-attack. So I guess I'll have to run north soon. Let's march back north. Our massive army. Well, I hope uh, someone alerted the appropriate people to take care of that. Uh, no. Okay, overworked soldiers. Less advantage. Or I could try diplomacy. Let's try diplomacy challenge. like that at least make for a good story. Ooh, free perk. And a one war at the same time. Excellent. Also a lot of valuable prisoners. Let's disband the army. And start building stuff here. For example, more pastoral lands. And here we will put some desert agriculture. And now this war is done. So, let's continue with the war right away. I might, but there are many movies and series still on my watch list that I need to go through first. I didn't even look how strong his armies are. Not very strong. Well then. Engineered for destruction. Oh, nice. Well, let's hope that it will. 
iron out itself. Okay, um, let's continue the conquest of Cairo. Okay, he can pay me back next month. You are not my courtier, so Oops, I want the Contessa. And you can have back your daughter for a lot of money. You can have your son your newborn son for some money. <laughs> we'll see about that. But I'm interested, definitely. Literally, especially next month there'll be the new expansion where you can do a lot more things with money and uh, apart from renown, money is the only thing that is kept through generations. Okay. What's innovative strategy do? You? Movement speed, but I lose battle roll. Let's try this. Okay. Which faction is dangerous? Ah, peasant rebel again. I can deal with that. else for matter. Can you serve Cairo? But I don't want yet. Oh, these are the Tulunids. Interesting. They used to be the rulers of Egypt. But a lot of things have happened in the meantime. <laughs> well, in the eventuality, in, uh, eventuality that I conquer everything, there's still stuff to do in uh, the next game, so I'll still convert it and see what comes next, especially since I'm really not good at Europa Universalis so far. I'm way better at Crusader Kings. Okay, that's more stuff captured. Does that count? Nope. So, I only did that for money, basically. Uh, let's put you all on the house arrest. Because I don't want disease in my dungeons. That's always a hassle to deal with. Mm, you could be a soldier. So let's force recruit you. Uh, ba -ba -ba -bum. Uh, maybe. I don't have that much time this week, so I'll have to see. Yeah, but uh, if he steals artwork, usually you can easily go in with copyright. Okay, another feast. Welcome, friends. Supply capacity. I think I will take organized march next. Well, every group of people has good and bad people. Uh, 
I need... What Barrows think of me is completely unimportant since they can't really rebel against me. So, let's be friends with the Duke instead. I get defender's advantage. Good, good. By the way, Johnny, I had the weirdest dream last night. I dreamt that I had to fight several um, beings from Russian and other Slavic mythology and even uh, the zombie of Rasputin. <laughs> yeah, was really weird. Oh, um, do I want my wife? Do I want to keep my wife? Yeah, I want to keep my wife. So let's try treatment. Yeah, and I have no idea why. The only thing that uh, had anything to do with that is that uh, I watched a movie where someone thought another person was Baba Yaga. Can I upgrade the temple? Yeah, I have the money for that. So let's do it. How many years until I get trebuchets? Eight years, okay. Okay, that's done. And I captured more people. Let's see who I can ransom. Oh, they all belong to you. Basically captured the entire family of this one duke. Oh, I completely forgot to send my marshal to Giza. I should do that now. Alright, what a good... Thanks for tuning in. And probably see you later in a week sometime. Okay, more ransoms. Yep, Giza is in need of a marshal in dire need. <coughs> Excuse me. Let's sell more prisoners. I want my grandson to be diligent, yep. Oh, that was the wrong way to go. That poor Emir will have no money left after I sold him back his entire family. Actually, the Pyramids of Giza give a really nice bonus. More Renown. Renown is the hardest resource to come by, so anything that can give me Renown is more than welcome. Oh, don't tell me they overthrew the Byzantine Empo Emperor again. Yep, they did. Well, that only makes it easier for me to attack him again. Well, technically you can with 
Um, where's the perk? With uh, writing history, you often get the option to um, to get some renown out of that, but it's really expensive. Another martial perk. Let's take organized march to make our wars even faster. Yep, because I'm not diplomacy focus. At this point in the game, I don't need diplomacy focus anymore. Again, I captured an entire family of someone. Poor guys. Oh, the Emir paid. Let's ransom himself. Whoops, what was that? More. Never enough gold. More gold. And also, uh, I did already take the entire blood tree, so... I'm not that desperate for more renown. It's always nice to have, but it's not entirely necessary. Okay, I can ransom you, and I can ransom you. Then, let's end this war. There's a peasant uprising. Where are they? Is it just here or are they somewhere else? Let's scan. Are oh, they on Byzantium as well? So. Let's put an army here in the mountains. And a secondary army near Byzantium. And raise them all. They can't even conquer Byzantium. They are too weak. Oh. You have finished your task. Now... Let's convert Antiochia. Disabled building in Cairo. I have to take a look at that. Oh, right, because I'm over my limit. Let's see. My grandson could use another title. So, here you go. Get Alpha Yum. This looks well upgraded already. Yep, it is. Let's also become the Emir of Cairo and give one of the duchies, for example, the duchy of phrase to my heir. Where is the duchy of phrase? Here it is. Okay, now I can instead build something more interesting in Cairo. I am considering getting the siege works, but I do want development here, so I will take the royal reserves instead. 
because Cairo can have a university. And I love universities. How's this uprising going? Build pastures in Gize. Where is it? I can ransom more prisoners. Uh, in 867. I just imprisoned someone else. Nope. You should go to house arrest. Also you... You... And that's all of them. Why can't I ransom you? Because he doesn't want you back. Huh. Okay. Well, have fun in prison then. So, I started in 867 as the Count of Cagliari, so I had like this territory here, these three counties I started with. Well, I didn't bully them right away, even though I did start early by snatching the territory they wanted to have. Peasant Rebel is destroyed. You are a decent enough soldier to recruit. Okay, now I have to remember. I think I need Direction and Epirus. Ah, I can look here. Yeah, Direction, Cephalonia, Epirus and Achaia for the Byzantian invasion. Hey Brokeman, welcome to the stream. So, let's start with Direction. And let the Duke handle the army. I have better things to do, like sitting on my throne. Oh, that's quite the extensive duchy, so I should start here. Hmm, one of my vessels has... A bastard daughter. Also, I think I will switch my marshal to Cairo now. After I rooted out the corruption in Giza. I mean, sure, I can get rid of the stress easily. We, um, what I'm doing right now, I'll have to see, I need to get uh, these four border duchies basically. And then I can declare a war to dismantle the entire Byzantine Empire. Which means that the title will be destroyed. All this territory will belong 
the Jura to the Roman Empire. And it will splinter into... Um, into singular kingdoms. I can take out easier. What's going on? Why can't I use the arrow keys? Now I can. Um, let's see... I kind of want the final thing from here. So let's go with Kin for now. Uh, what did I want to do? Right, I wanted to build an Alexandria. Which one will give me development? This one. Okay. Continue. Think the Byzantines are in a civil war once again? Yep. So, I won't have many problems conquering them. Um, I forgot that I have to take Constantinople as my capital again. But I will do this after this war. I think I should speed up a little more, even though I upgraded my siege engines as much as I could. It still takes a while, especially in these mountainous regions. You just lost Georgia. So let's just ransom her right away. Okay, this is going really fast. Even though there is a harsh winter now. I could indulge in drink soon. Since paranoid really causes a lot of stress. What's happening with you? Ugh. You are having some problems, my son. That's another siege done. And more prisoners to sell. really worth it. How are your supplies doing? Still okay. I really need better siege engines to make this even faster. Nope. Uh, Napoli has a problem. Okay, that's just an issue because you are not the best steward I could take. What does this belong to? Ah, this just has two reinforced baronies, so... Ah, my grandson became a witch. And he's still a leper. 
with a pretty useless wife. That's something I have. I might have to change up later. Oh, I could try right now. 23%. Yep. Let's bribe two people to join me. And after that, I'll just get really drunk. Conquest done. And let's just ransom her right away. Now, let's get drunk. thing is, I don't need claims. I'm the Roman Emperor. They just say this belongs to the Empire now. Of course she's extra vigilant. Oh, I built in Antioch. Castle next. What am I the Duke of again? Cairo and Palestine. Okay. Oh, scheme has been discovered. I can invite one more person. that maybe later when I can reduce my stress again uh, paranoid is really not a good trait to have gives you so much stress which is understandable if you're paranoid but still not much fun can imprison more people since I'm not compassionate I can do that without a problem wait how is my health still fine despite being a drunk lunatic perfect first emperor <laughs> well everyone who poses me uh, is a heretic will actually come into place a little bit later because uh, eventually I will start my own imperial cult yep take your time Brookman Despot of Epirus, but you can't do much against me. Especially if he, I take your capital right away. More prisoners to ransom. Let's split up the forces a little bit. Uh, I can send 6,000 here. Oops, not the mangonels though. How many 
money can I send here? Also 6,000. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. Then I have to split you up. Ah, that was fast. Welcome back. Okay, I uh, can only keep 3,000 here and about 3,000 here. Okay. It's not a lot. I have so many levies. Don't really know what to do with. 2,000 here. How many here? Also 2,000. Ah, that's always the most annoying part. Uh, 3,000... No. Yeah, 3,000 here. Then... That's still too many. 3,000 here. And 7,000 here. Okay, that should do it. Okay, finally. That's resolved. Wish you could do something like supply trains or stuff like that. Since this is incredibly annoying. I'm still losing supplies from the winter. And I accidentally sent two armies here, so let's send one north. There's the Byzantines. Let's stay here until I have some supplies. And send them against Byz Byzantine army. Yeah, sure, let's invest more money. It's not like I don't have it to spare. Another Marshall perk. Where is it? Uh, let's take the Parthian tactics. Um, <laughs> yeah, realism is a thing. And don't ask the weaponsmiths of Mars for any reasonable weaponry. That fails. Um, let's go to Etolia next. And if I gain Etolia, that should end the war. Oh, I have a Despotissa. Let's 
Get her first. My steward died. Mysteriously. And let's get someone who likes me, for example, you. Oh, I built in Gizeh. Who's not useless? So what happened here? Cooperative stonemasons. Ah, okay, that's why I built so fast. Ah, yeah. But only because uh, the scheme da got discovered right away, so... Ooh, famous champion, skill tactician. Awesome. So my grandson became an excellent fighter even though he's a leper. Sounds like he belongs in Darkest Dungeon. If you know that game where the leper is a really strong fighter. will kill some, but I don't feel like doing all that stuff again. It's just too much ha too much hassle. Oh, I lost stress. Cool. And I won the war. Okay. Who else is in this war? It's just you? That means I can send my guys over here. And that will immediately end the war as well. And I have way too many holdings again. So... Let's see... You can have a holding. And your son can have two more holdings. And then you're a bastard, so you don't get any holdings. Don't think I can grant you titles. Nope. So, let's go through the list. Comes Cornelius. You get this title. Royal Forest in Cairo. Excellent. Let's turn them into orchids or orchards. I actually don't really know the name for it. Okay, my siege will take 40 days. Yours might be faster. So, I will order an assault on the fort if necessary. And 
that's it with that war. Let's take a look at our prisoners. Let's move them all to house arrest. Unless someone's a really good fighter, then I'll force recruit them. Under house arrest. Don't want full dungeons. They're just not worth it anymore. I used to be in Crusader Kings 2. <laughs> yeah, that's exactly how I know their names too. Yeah, basically, I think my grandson just found out because he's a really decent intrigue guy that there's a plot to kill his wife. And uh, that basically destroyed everything. Um, am I holding too many duchies? Nope. But you are quite powerful. And so are you. So, you are my new spy master. And you are my new steward. Are you a better chancellor? Not really, but I don't need a good chancellor. Hmm? Ah, I can't fire you because you had a hook on me. Right, uh, well then, let's try to sway my new spy master, so he doesn't try to kill me himself. Hey Brokeman, what's up? Okay, you are in another civil war, so that might end by itself. Let's see. Stay hydrated. That's a good idea. Let me see. My water bottle is over here. Cheers. Okay. What's the coastal duchy? Long dock. Let's take that. Coastal duchies are always good. And is this part of it? Yes, it is. So I should start here in the north. My army is really seeing the entire world. Will you... you are... attacking my son in a liberty war. Castrum of, of Steyr. Uh, yeah, sure. Take it. Oh, the petty king of Wessex. I am shaking in my boots. They are quite formidable together, but they can't do anything against me. Really. After all, we are the Roman Empire, and we're getting quite blobby by now. Ah, only have it on speed 2, no wonder this is taking so long. Uh, 
But I really want these coastal regions. They're super nice to have. Three, two, one. Got them. Here comes the Aquitanian army. Okay, I got a hook on my daughter for whatever reason. How is Swabia doing? I accidentally sent him my granddaughter, which apparently doesn't cause an alliance. Speed up a little more. Uh, you sure become my friend. Why not? Yep, and technically the Byzantines are still Rome. They even were called the Roman Empire at their time, but still. I have declared myself a true heir to Rome, so... Okay, that's one army beat. Here comes the King of Wessex. But too late. Speed up again. <laughs> yeah, Lichtenstein. Let's see if there even is Lichtenstein here. Uh, it should be somewhere here, right? Uh, Konstanz, Zürich. Uh, shouldn't it be somewhere here? And I think this should be Lichtenstein. Since Faduz sounds similar to Vaduz, which is the capital of Liechtenstein. So it might be here. And it is actually part of the Roman Empire. So yeah, kinda. <laughs> Oh, apparently he's already retreating. Alexandria finished another building project. So let's give it the next one. What's going on here? Oh, holy war. Yeah, but that, uh, that's quite a roundabout claim since, uh, because they say they are the new seat of the Orthodox Church. So they are the heir to Byzantium, which is the heir to Rome, so, yeah, <laughs> a little bit weird, but let them have the fun. Okay, my son is doing really, really bad, despite supposedly being very intelligent. Oh. This area here is um, where my parents will go next week. Vivier is under siege, so I will have to counterattack once again. Am 
come on, finish this. Can't wait until I get trebuchets for even faster. Sieges. Uh, and I lost supplies. But I can ransom a lot of prisoners again. At the very least. Oh, faction. French Orthodox. And peasant rebel in Jerusalem. Oh. I have a new patriarch. Let's make him my court physician. And also I successfully swayed my spy master. Yeah, ransom. Here you are. Okay, this should be quite the one-sided battle. Once again, one-sided battle. But at least I'm getting a lot of war score out of it. And if I capture the king... The war is won immediately anyway. Nope, didn't capture the king, but still... 43% war score just from battles won, so... <laughs> exactly. Conquer it to make it a little bit nicer for them to arrive there. Well, the true reason, the actual true reason is that I uh, just wanted to have this coastal region. And later I'll continue on into Spain. And also I want Paris at some point, so... Yeah, there's a lot of things I want to conquer. Okay, I can convert more. For example... Gizeh should be Christian. I think. Because that will make it a lot easier to hold it. Is there anything beyond? Is Foi also part of this duchy? Apparently it is. It's a very weirdly shaped duchy since Toulouse is not in it for some reason. But yeah, Toulouse is famously its own duchy, but still. Slightly weird. Ah, he's already retreating again. Um, a little bit, especially since boats are really expensive. And you do get uh, one month of basically seasickness in your army. Why are you the Duke of Freys? What happened to my son? Did he lose that duchy already? <sighs> yep. Which isn't too much, but still very annoying. to deal with. I mean, if your army is way larger than the enemy's army, you don't really care about it. Yep, but the Normans had the advantage that when they landed here, the uh, English were all the way over here, so... Because they just defeated the Norwegian invasion in the north. Uh, 
Uh, what do you mean? I don't really follow Johnny. Let's make the counters more efficient. I feel like I'm missing context here. Ah, okay, that's the con context. I only get sick in cars when I try to read a book. Otherwise, I if I don't have to drive myself, I sleep like a baby. Yeah, you could phrase it that way. Definitely. I could take this county next. I have nothing to lose. Ha ha ha. My spy master drank himself to death. Congratulations. Finish this way scheme before I start the next one. Even though the Normans were so assimilated into French culture by that point that you could barely call them Vikings anymore. Okay. 95% on almost everything. Uh, let's get an intrigue perk. Ah, okay. Let's see, scheme power. Let's make more dread gain. Since I don't think I'll get another one soon. And my character is kinda built for dread anyway. I could host another feast. Before I do that, I think I should try to murder you and invite some people to help you for example that's this war one And then I can host a feast to get rid of all the stress again. And then invite uh, invite another accomplice. And now I have too many. Counties under my direct control again. You know what? Let's actually give you Montpellier instead. And I will give Uze to someone else. Comus Cornelius, you can have seven more counties. One, two, three, four, five. Here you go. Well, you want a seat on the council, but I can't give you the Patriarch seat since 
I haven't changed the religion yet. Ah, I was wondering for a moment, that's just a similar color. Why I would own this duchy over here. Okay, let's see. Who could we attack next? I don't want to attack Swabia. I uh, don't really care about these areas, to be honest. Could take Lyria. But then I'd have to march from here. He has no allies though, so let's just take it. Oh, I almost forgot. How bad is a peasant rebel? Not bad. So we still have lots of time until it comes. So this should be this should go quickly. Welcome friends. How high is the chance? 56% just. Well, I'll have to invite someone else. Oh, he's already considering. And I can't afford another one, I fear. Nope. So let's hope 83% is enough. There might be events that strengthen it. Why am I allied to you again? Mm, discussion on strategy. Plus two marshal, not bad. You're some random guy in the west trunk here. Why am I allied to you? Because Gottfried Welf, your son married my daughter. Don't remember doing that, but ah, whatever. Uh, who cares about a baro? Literally, a baron is just. A punching bag in this game. Uh, yep, you can die from illness, you can die from stress, you can drink yourself to death. If you're a um, a flagellant, you can flagellate yourself to death. There's many, many ways to die. He's not swayed. So let's try our charms on our spy master next. And let's beat up a lot. And they die like flies. Hmm. Duke of Dukes, yeah. No. The Pope? No. A He's just a courtier. So let's take a duke and maybe he'll become more powerful over time. Oh, Cairo and Gizeh are already under control. Uh, what isn't? These areas aren't really under control. So let's help my son by increasing control in Montpellier. Oh, and right, this guy died, so I need a replacement. <laughs> yep, you can actually die from a heart attack if you get if your character gets too stressed out. This guy is now a count. Oh, the Duke of Apulia. Sure.
and you can sod off, basically. Okay, that was fast. Eh, uh, sure, I don't want a long siege. Okay, uh, that's another too many. So, let's grant it to that guy that's becoming more and more powerful. Because I keep giving him lands. But he is from my extended family, so shouldn't be too much of an issue. I could take Crete. Uh, or I could take something from Egypt. Is there anything interesting left in Egypt? Not really. I could take this coastal region. But let's look for more interesting stuff. Like for example, this guy who's in a civil war. I could take... Uh, which one is the one with Paris in it? This one. Uh, but I don't think I want a disconnected territory. So let's go for Burgundy first. Let's show the golds. That... The Roman Empire is back and coming for them. And hope there's no asterix. Still no kingdom titles I can take. Now, oh, I can ransom more prisoners. Or I could if he had the money for it. Okay, this is the area I want to conquer. Here, the I think the most. Famous place should be Dijon, because of the mustard, even though I hate mustard, but even I know about it. Oh, I can imprison. Oh, she already is imprisoned. Never mind. Well, those conquests are really not bad for a drunk lunatic. I'd say. I may be drunk and insane, but that won't stop me. Rival, you say? How about an execution then? Or I could torture her. Yeah, sure. Let's torture a little bit. Well, that's pretty much what I'm doing. I 
basically hate that woman for whatever reason. And since she's in my dungeons, I can do with her whatever I want to relieve some stress. Some people say medieval times were barbaric. He, your uncle doesn't want you back, so he will stay imprisoned. If I need some quick stress relief, I can just execute her. And here goes another emperor. Another Byzantine. We have a tendency to die a lot. <laughs> and the next emperor is a 10 year old. How fitting. Okay, you like me now, which. is definitely preferable. How quickly do you make money? Quick enough that I can wait. Well, we're starting to blob quite a bit. Oh, I can call a hunt. Which will relieve me of 90 stress. Okay, let's do that a little bit later since... Such a massive stress release should be left for if we really need it. Does anyone, if you watched Asterix or read it, uh, remember roughly where the village was? Was it somewhere around here? Could work off some stress. Yeah, let's do that. Me neither, but I think it was somewhere around here. I could be wrong though. Um, I quickly check in with. I, oh, I forgot to move my capital once again. How much more? Four. Okay. Four more development until I can build my next university. Which helps extremely well with development. Yep. Pretty much. Even my air is 30 now. Uh, 40, I mean. And he's severely injured. But the Byzantine Emperor is 10. And his stats aren't too good, so... I don't think he'll really do much against me. Oh. Can Ransom count uh, Berenger? And his wife. Well, someone tried to murder my wife. Oh no. Anyway. Hmm. Let's ransom you. I think you learned your lesson. Well, if I hurry up this with this war, 
I might even um, end the truce right away, since there'll be a new king in town. And looking at how well my siege engines are doing, it shouldn't be too hard. I think with that I control... Oh no, I need... Uh, what's it called? Tonner... Tonnerroi? I took a prisoner. Your son and heir. And you don't want him back because you're greedy. Wow, you're great, mom. Won't even free your own son from prison. Upgrade. And in Antioch. Let's upgrade the trade port. Oh, and of course... What should I make Roman next? Let's go with Cairo. Give him some Roman culture. Speed this up. Two, one. Let's turn our roi. Dijon's next. This is pretty heavily fortified, I have to say. I might just rampage... Oh, the countryside is also heavily fortified. Huh, then let's march on Paris, I guess. Sappers will be a really good perk when I get it, since it'll speed up my sieges by a lot, I think. Okay, I have everything under control that I wanted, so now let's just march through random countryside and devastate it until they surrender. Right? Yep, I have everything. So now I also have ticking Warsco on my side. Yeah, yeah, 55% chance and 3 fails in a row. Never tell me the odds. Okay. Oh, right. You've called on an ally. Interesting. By the way, how's your civil war doing? Oh, I have to hurry up. So, no time caring about supplies. Oh, 
Ah, you're ma mostly from Lost Battles, so it'll be a while. Well, let's improve relations with the Duke. I don't really need more levies. I already have too many, to be honest. Oh, peasant rebel. And a big one this time. So, no declaring war again until I have that under control. That's the conquest of France, or at least that part of France. And now I'll have to give away titles again. You get Macon and Chalon. And now that you are at maximum size, we will look for the next best from my dynasty. You are even unlanded. That means you will be really grateful for more land. Give you all of this. Now we're really eating away at France. Okay. Now begins the annoying part. Looking for where the peasants are revolting in Jerusalem for one. Then, Byzantium, where I also want to move my capital while we're at it. No, I don't want to reclaim Rome, because in this time, By uh, Byzantium is actually the better city. Okay, Antiochia, Napoli, Padua, that's quite the uprising, yeah. Padua, Genoa, And last but not least, Siena. The only university I have built so far. Then, let's take a look at who we still have in our prisons. House arrest, house arrest, house arrest, house arrest. Okay. I wish you could sort them by um, prowess to see who could, who would be worth force recruiting. How is my health? Still fine after all those years. You want your wife back finally. You can have her. You're a 
Baro, you're a Baro. So why should I care about you guys? Speed up again. And after I've defeated the Peasant Uprising... No, I want to keep rifles in my prison. Hook on Kaiser Liberius will expire soon. Don't think I can... Oh, I can actually modify the feudal contract. No. It has already been changed. Can I do anything else with it? Nope. And you're dealing with your own peasants right now. Hmm. Oh, someone joined Rome. They didn't like that they're not my capital anymore. Someone has been excommunicated. Well, that's just a shame. Mm, I could ransom you, but it's not worth it yet. She isn't. And she's from my dynasty, so let's just ransom her. Okay, with that. Um, where are my rivals? Ah, oh, I can just look in my social tab. Okay, rivals, here we are. Let's have a little bit of torture to calm down. Oh, you're too young to torture. Five more months. Four months. Next month I will raise my armies. Uprising. Oh wait, where is you busy with Montpellier? But we had a peasant uprising, I think. Or did I already fix that? I apparently already fixed that. Okay. Then never mind. Come on. Finish your uprising. Byzantine Empire has another civil war, it seems. Or four civil wars. Wouldn't be the Byzantine Empire without it. Domitian of Spoleto. 
ist decent. But I have no open positions. I'm sorry. And excuse my stomach. Come on, peasants. Oh, trebuchets. Excellent. And let's get some hoardings now. Since I don't have to siege. Let's get rid of the mangonels and replace them with trebuchets. Please, two regiments and full size. Okay. Any of these battles problematic? Nope. Oh, I guess okay. Oh, this battle isn't going too well. Actually. So that's the only one I'm losing. Antiochia. Call my random count, but I don't really want to. Tower houses in Cairo. Upgrade the castle then. Oh, also Alexandria and Antioch. Completely overlooked that. Don't think I can build in Antioch right now since it's under siege. Yep, shame. And of course, the largest uprising is in a county where I have the least um, soldiers. Well, um, back to that, uh, sorry. Life has been okay, I guess. Could be better, could be worse. Lots of issues with my grandma, since she's getting really old, and... She has some problems, so... But, luckily, at least nothing too major. And you? How's been life been treating you? Okay, Byzantium. Where I completely missed a civil war. Well, look for yourself. This is the Roman Empire right now. To me it looks like I'm winning. Right now I'm starting the complete takeover plan of Byzantium once again. Okay, which do I need? I think Epirus is next. Yes, Epirus. Eh, unlikely to happen since I pruned the family tree quite a bit to prevent that. Okay, let's get rid of all these banners.
maintain him. How are you? How's the YouTube video coming along? That's good to hear, Rootman. Okay, um, where do I want to march? Into Ioannina. I don't want to come out myself. I have people who do that for me. Okay. I uh, actually finished rendering uh, episode 4 today. I, if I'm not uploading it later in the night, I'll upload it tomorrow. Oh uh, yeah, rendering is always... I by now know the pains of rendering. Since uh, my YouTube uploads were like... Uh, several hours each lately. Ah, the program Vegas. I thought, wait a minute, you liked Fallout New Vegas. <laughs> I'm using Shotcut myself. Um, yeah, I think so. What about your demos video? Ugh. Good thing I decided against using most effects so far. But I'll probably. Well, problem finding is trouble or troubleshooting is always a massive hassle. Yeah, I mean, once I do the highlight, the highlight reel of this campaign, that will be quite a thing too. So. Because I do want to add in memes and stuff like that. And I have to do heavy sound editing. Because who wants to watch a video where they hear like one word from a sentence. All over the place. Yep. But uh, CK3, I have to say, is... Uh, is very thankful to edit since you can usually see stuff happening pretty fast in the footage. Oh, no, I want to send you to Alexandria actually. Also, since I always detach the uh, audio, I can just look at the audio where big things are happening. Mm, that's right. Yep, good, good, good. Well, have you looked at my thumbnails? Uh, I don't think you have to fear much. Yep. 
I think if you keep editing for 14 hours, you also get synesthesia at some point when you can actually see the sound. I'm back to speed too. I mean, I add in, I added in a meme last video uh, into the thumbnail, but it was pretty low effort. So I always try to find a good. I have a, a good uh, face from a footage from my current ruler or uh, a meme to put as the person looking at what is happening and then I take a screenshot of um, something that fits the video well. For example, in the Holy War video uh, there was the Crusader looking at the Muslim territories in southern Italy. Yep. Memes, the DNA of a soul. I don't remember the actual um, intonation used at that point. It's been too long since I looked at it. And also I think... Uh, the entire thumbnail? Ah, you mean the text. Well, I am fiddling around with the text and hopefully... I'm not content with how I put the text in, but... Didn't have any better ideas so far. I might try black outline, white font next time. Or the other way round. Well, your videos at least are actually uh, edited. Mine are just... I'm just editing out bad takes and stuff like that, so... Um... I... That's actually intentional because uh, in the logo they use the lowercase p for paradox. So I thought I'd also write it in lowercase. <laughs> oh, he's actually out of money. And he's out of soldiers. 4,000, and I don't see them anywhere. We have 300 here. Disputed, disputed heritage, but he has all my. Yep, he's broke by now, because I already took everything from him. Okay, I have conquered what I need, so now let's go ravage the countryside a little bit. Also, interesting banner for the Roman Empire. Don't remember the original Roman Empire having a double-headed eagle, to be honest. But that might be just bad. <laughs> exactly.
It's their fault for not surrendering after I have everything I need. Ah, oh, hydrate. That's a good idea. Let's do that. Oop. Gain the stress levels because my best friend died. Oh boy. Whoops, I dropped the bottle cap. Here it is. Okay. Let's see if I can just torture some rivals to relieve my stress. I could torture one. Then let's just go on a hunt. Son? Ah, right, from my disgraced son. Still no Byzantine army inside. Oh, let's save the Pope's life. Maybe he'll like me then. Okay. Holy War and another Holy War. Uh, this this is part of my empire. This is Athens, and you need Athens to declare yourself Roman Emperor. Or well, actually, I think it's called no, it's called Athens. Achaia is the island or peninsula. With Sparta and stuff. Is Sparta actually a holding here? Should be down here somewhere. Mistra. This is Corinth. Huh, no mention of Sparta. You mean Crete? No, that's still uh that's still by some Muslim ruler. If you mean this one. Yeah. No, Crete is still under Muslim rule. Another smallpox outbreak. I think that's the third I had this game. Disease has actually been an issue. I could host a feast, but I don't have a stress that requires me to hold a feast. Oh, I conquered Gadik here. Let's continue to Demetrius. And while I'm at it, I'm actually beating down the peasant revolt for them. Oh, how cute. A claim. As if anyone would try to attack me. So, now we move through the countryside with our brand new trebuchets. Ah, 11.6 a day. That's good to see. And my son has lost the smallpox. Excellent. More pupil to ransom. Haha! <laughs> That's if I ever add 
sound cues, I'll definitely add that one. <laughs> I mean, it's all very benevolent. We just want to spread the glory of Rome to people who really want to be in a Roman Empire, even if some of them don't know it yet. Court physician, okay. No idea why we had to capture that one. Oh, I built an Alexandria. Let's build more. For example, some watchtowers. Also, I could become the Duke of Alexandria at some point. Oh, that's enough. And then I will start another assassination. But first I'll have to give away some lands. One, two, three, four. Grand titles. And I think I can take the Despotet of Epirus now. So I declared myself king once again. Okay, let's start the murder scheme. Oh, that's actually pretty decent. 36% without accomplices. And I only need to invite one person. To the scheme. Excellent. Let's get drunk. And then... Way my spy master. So, okay. Nice. Okay, where was I? Right. Assassination. Again, a liberty faction. Ugh. Annoying. Peasant rebel will take a while. So, can I take more Aquitaine? I could. What about Frank here? Oh, Frank here. Restore. Hmm. Not yet Valois. Orleans could be nice. Champagne could be nice, but I think let's go for Orleans. Oh, one, two, three, four, five, six. Orleans, one, two, three, four, five. So let's go for Champagne, since it's a little bit more to take. Blinking colors are making it hard to see what I need to conquer. Okay, this all here. Uh, let's go to Song first. 
Terrorize all armies. Use this Duke. And let's go for Song. Uh, I'll have Sapper soon. Which will be extremely good. How much longer? 37 days, so I'll probably... Uh, I'll get it before my army even starts marching. That's good. Advanced bone making in 4 years, hoardings in 8 years. Speech to the crowd. Whoop. And Seppers. Now, I only need a strategist and then I can continue onto a completely different lifestyle. Slowly but surely take gold back. Oh, you're no longer an agent, but I don't need you really. And they lost another holy war. Damn. But they still have. Like Ukraine and all this area of Russia. For whatever reason. If I have them, I'd rather concentrate on keeping the realm I have together than conquering new lands. Somewhere completely else. Yeah, sure. Private garden. By the way, how is my health? Still fine at 68. While my son is a mess. Because I w why wouldn't he be a mess? Macron. Still the Duke of Epirus, even though I took that duchy as well. Oh, he died in my dungeons. Ah, scheme discovered, of course. So I need to invite more people. Like you. And you. Done once again. Okay, two agents joined. Now I need to get rid of my stress again. Twenty seven. Yep. Twenty seven stress. Then I can invite more people. Come on, who wants to kill him? You, for example. Valeria. Oh! The great table is seating 
upper nobility on the dice, gave a loud crack, and moments later it gave in under the weight of food and gilded decoration. As my most distinguished guests, and I had to be fitted among the lower nobility, I ended up, up close to my daughter, Kaiserissa Honoria. Dux Sempronius took it poorly, however, and told everyone it was a grave injustice to be seated with lords and ladies barely better than commoners. Acting quite the opposite, Comus Romanos displayed grace and humility among his lessers. Noria and I ended up talking all evening and agreed it should not be the last time we feasted and laughed in each other's company. Kaiserissa Honoria, my daughter, became my friend. Still trying to kill the Basileus. Joinville has been conquered. Good, good. Ben Chalon. Gretel. Rhin. And Provence, and also more. Oh, more! They make an excellent brie, brie in more. Really tasty. Best brie I ever ate. Yeah, someone else. Faction has disbanded. Faction was created. You win some, you lose some. I can create more titles, apparently. Ah, the Duchy of Epirus is now a creatable title. Since that one guy gave up the title after not controlling every anything there anymore. Gem Crookie, Hydrate, of course. I will do that. Welcome, welcome. I didn't see you here. Is um, Retro already finished with his stream? Did I miss the raid or are you just coming here? Or did you raid someone else for a change? Well, that was easy. Another prisoner. Ah, okay. Cool, cool. The Roman Empire is growing and growing, as you can see. So, this campaign is going really well right now. Even though my son is pretty awful in some regards, because he just is permanently stressed. Frederic Chateau. West friend here is a mess. Defending on against Prince Grieg and Prince Grieg. That's weird. Oh, you promoted the culture in Cairo. That's good. By the way, do the pyramids increase development? A little bit. Is it worth it? 26? 
Uh, sure, let's promote more culture. <laughs> yeah, pretty much. You're definitely not wrong, my friend. And that's... How many of them have I killed now? One, two... Well, just two. Apparently. Oh, I was pretty tame. At least with Byzantine Emperors so far. Come on. Finish your siege. We need to keep going. Two more. I want that Bree. Because it's the best Bree ever. Wait a second. Why is the capital of Paris Melun and not Paris? You're not taking back that duchy. Oh, let's actually trap them. Now they can't retreat. And I get all the war score I need to finish this. I think I'll ransom you since I have enough war score anyway. And if not, I'll just go one north to. Yeah, it's still 100% war score, so let's enforce the demands. Let's see, the Dutch, the Duke of Burgundy can have one more. Let's give him Trois. And then, let's see if my heir has lost more counties. No, he hasn't. Then, let's find someone new to grant titles to. For example... Comes Barisone. He can have one, two, three, four, five, six, so he can get one more title after this. And then... Is the she... Is ransomed. Peasant rebel, 19 months. Should be long enough. Liberty faction will also still take a while, so... Let's try to take the peninsula of Achaia. Liberty War and Athenian claim on the Duchy of Achaia. Can I help you? Well, I can convert you first of all. Can't really help you. But I could, in the meantime, just take, I think it was Cephalonia? Yeah, Cephalonia. 
that should also go a little bit quicker, so... I shouldn't have issues finishing the war quickly. And also it reduces the border go in Greece. All those claimants that I don't need. Also considering my vessels and converting. You're the Pope, you will never convert. Anyone who needs to be orthodox but isn't yet. Not really. Lady of Tyrol is Bavarian, but I can't do much there. I just converted you, so... this going? Who I am I exposed? Oh, the Occitans have advanced bow making. That's why. Also, universities in Cairo, Bologna, Padua, Napoli. Okay. So nothing unexpected. Liberty faction has become dangerous. But I just befriended a duke. Which brought the f faction under the threshold again. have to crush that Byzantine army soonish. But first I get my ticking war score. Which vessel? Oh, the Duke of Cephalonia. Not that I care. not too bad, but I don't really need him. Let's speed this up. I could work off some stress, which I will do immediately. And then I need to charm my marshal. friends. No, oh, infection got dangerous again. No, it's a peasant rebel actually. The 
Duchess of Athens. Died during birth, I think. If I see that right. Complications related to obesity. Obesity. Okay. Well then. Um, she was my friend. I already went under the threshold. So I don't need to do much anymore. And the final martial perk. Strategist. Which gives me one diplomacy, three martial, plus 25% enemy casualties. And crosses water without advantage penalties. Nice. So, I think next I will become a scholar. Apparently some Byzantines really want to die. But the Emperor managed to flee. What a shame. So peasant rebel in Napoli again and in Antiochia. By the way, talking about that, ah, I already regained everything. So how about in Epedros? And we're back. Yeah, Brokeman, welcome back. Okay, that gave me a lot of war score. Yeah, 50% war score in just one battle. And he lost in a Liberty War. And that was quick. So be it. Alright, time to murder another Byzantine Emperor. No, only 9% chance now. They are getting harder to kill. Oh. Oh, but I did just... Yep, pretty much. I did just have a mental breakdown, so I shouldn't get another one so soon. Oh, also... Peasant rebel in Napoli and Antiochia. So let's take care of that. Napoli, Napoli. I think this is Napoli. Yep. That's Napoli. And Antiochia should be here. Yeah, yeah. Don't be so dramatic, music. I know. Let 
me quickly look what time it is. Oh, not too late. I can still go for a while. Maybe not several hours, but long enough. Come on. Turn of the month. Excellent. Faction has disbanded. French Catholic populists. Good, good. You've converted Alexandria. So off to the next conversion. In Cairo. Where I just constructed a keep. Oh, also I should build a new city here. In Kuzlum. And upgrade my farms and fields. They can take care of themselves. Torture her first. That's better. And then ransom her. Torture. And then ransom. Take him anymore. Still need more stress release. Well, then, keep torturing. And one more. I'm 70 and my health is still fine. Any of you I can ransom? Not anymore. How about you? Yeah, no problem. Thanks for tuning in, broke man. See you. Hey, watchtowers in Alexandria. Not entirely sure how much longer I will continue. Ah, yes. <laughs> you can try. Didn't I? No, you were there for a long time. Oh, he died from torture. Soldier source. That sounds good. There is a peasant uprising. I am waiting. Come on, can send ultimatum at any time. Sure, you can have your husband back. Oh, what's happening now? 
Ja, mehr Torte. Hm, wir keep dying. Oh, Alexandria has been added to it. Completely missed that. I'll just have to march south then. You can just keep standing there. I'll give you this guy so you don't suffer as much. You can create a new title, but I don't really want to. Oh, I forgot to unmark these stress things. Now my rivals keep dying from the torture. I knew it. Let's bribe two more. Really drunk. So we can. No, oh, that's actually already happened. Can I torture some more? For stress relief. I could execute you. Yeah, sure. Maybe. You're not really worth it, so I'll put you under house arrest instead. Okay, now I can develop my capital. Or not, since that will put me over the stress threshold. Big oof. I'm still charming Dux Avitus. That's good. Three months. I don't need a lover. Sure, I'll join my brother. Promise your lifestyle. Mm. Let's get the befriend scheme actually. Do it. Do it. Then I can take a higher, and then I'll have the next dream for the final war against the Byzantine Empire. Uh, a zero year old. I want. Ach ja, wenn I have the Greek Heartlands. Um, where did I put my banners? Ah, right, the peasant uprising. And then let's march on the peninsula. Oh, 
Uh, my wife died. That means I need a new one. Preferably infertile. And with good skills. That would ally me with Lainster. That would ally me with Vaucouleur. But you are very old. Let's take you instead. How many wives did I have? One. Oops. That will be my second, third, fourth wife. Alliance with Petty King. What is he called? Ethel here, here where it's on, of Leinster. Wow, the Duchy of Katanes controls more Scotland than Scotland. And Scotland isn't cal called Alba anymore, which is also something new. Let's take on the Greeks. <laughs> you marched on my capital. Well, fat chance. I made sure that my capital is very hard to conquer. And it'll only get worse once I get my hoardings. City, so I'll march this way instead. And I captured a lot of valuable targets again. It's cute how they're trying to march in Constantinople. With very much not enough troops to even put a dent into it. More prisoners to ransom. Someone sent me a gift. Might be, might be part of a murder scheme, but this guy is so old and still in fine health. By the way, do you have children already? Not yet, and your wife is getting old. expected. 
And I don't think you have that much money. And also you're in a civil war. So I'll have to hurry up with my sieges. Learning perk. Let's become scientific. Gain progress faster. Now we're gaining progress in three years. Excellent. Oh, by the way. Now the Pope and this Duke here guy still don't want to cha me to change. The succession rules. And I think as soon as I am ready for war, for the final war, that's a good cutoff point. So I will finish this, get ready for the final war against the Byzantines, and then I will end the stream. North next. Oh, someone's trying to kill me. I should disrupt schemes. Auto save. I want to siege this down. So yeah. Never mind about the claimant. Also, Georgia became a sultanate. Interesting. Avitas has been swayed even more. Let's continue. Actually, let's Romans my wife. Who is called Elfled.
interesting name and also nice wall score. I can host another grand right. Good, good. Ancient Grimoire it is. Another Intrigue perk. Noise. Now I'll get Dark Insights. Let's see... Who wants some torture? I'll actually recruit you instead. But you... You definitely want some torture. And... You definitely want some torture. So do you. And you. Oh, you actually want to be in my army. And you want torture. So do you. You're wearing a crown, but for no reason. That means torture. And more torture. And torture. Also, for a change, torture. Even more torture. And more torture. You, we are nice, we are sending you to house arrest. And that's it. That's all the torture I could do. increased my intrigue by quite a bit which should help me against the murder scheme against me of Kazaria, Liberty War, claim on the Byzantine Empire, Prince Michael, do I wonder let's just compliment the taste. Advanced bow making, and we are also now exposed to hoardings. Excellent! That will speed up everything a lot. Our bowmen now do more damage, 
And we can make crossbowmen. Two, one. Ill dogs, yeah. You still need time. Oh, he actually defended his realm against Prince Gweek. Huh. Actually, a murder scheme against me worked once. Okay, let's repay my loan. Then... Host a feast. Choose a lifestyle. Uh, scholarship. Reorganize my shall be my marshal. Uh, you're all not really good at this. Spy master. Let's take the Dukes of Apulia. The Dukes of Spoleto. And the Comes of Venezia. Then I need to give my son several duchies. Like Corsica, Lombardy, Venice, Calabria, Hanoia, Croatia, Sachlumia, Rashka. Sicily, Vienna, Tunis, Palestine, Montpellier, and Antiochia. Oops, did I give away control of Antiochia? Damn it. That was not my intention. Wait a second, my succession. Okay. It's fixed. Not a member of my house. No idea where you came from. Uh, weren't you supposed to be a bastard? Ah, but you made your own dynasty. Okay. That's why. Okay. Well then. Uh, you're a pretty awful wife. And my son also has an awful wife. Let's install the Ducks of Burgundy. And then... Which ones can I give away? For example, Calvi. Gomez Proho can have ten titles. One, two, three, four, 
Five. Mm. Six. And let's give him Genoa. Okay, the Despotisa, not yet. We have awful ducks. Don't need him. Let's weigh you so I get my money back. the Imperator. Welcome friends. Any new titles? Nope. I think I can build in Alexandria now. Yep. Okay, my money should fix itself next month when I regain full control of my holdings. For some reason, I now have a favor hook on you. Okay. Oh, my eye itches. Sorry for that. Next time, then let's host the Grand Ride. More the merrier. Read from an ancient grimoire. One diplomacy perk. to rule, so I improve my son. Ransom this guy. Let's ransom her finally, even if it doesn't give me much, but I will usurp her kingdom, after which I will have nothing. Paulus and Kaiser Remus. Now I can use uh, Hellas. Then I think 
think my son has everything. Yep. Okay. Who of my dynasty doesn't have that much? You still have more than enough. Looks Quintius of Burgundy, you also have more than enough. Who's next? You are unlanded. So, land in Greece. Okay, I need more fame for that. But I am now prepared to march against the Byzantine Empire and end it once for all as soon as I can gain more prestige. <laughs>